Appreciate it. Thank you. No problem. huge unfolding story in Australia and right around the world, but we can't bring it to you in the normal way. Why? It's affecting us at Sky News, at Foxtel, many customers, many users, many businesses. What's happened is we believe a malware company called CrowdStrike has essentially gone down. If we have a look at our studio here, this is what it looks like on many computers right around the world. Now, um, technical operators call this the BSOD, the BSOD, the blue screen of death. People are loading, systems are crashing, they're loading again and again and again. It's on a loop. So many companies are unable to work right now, including Sky News. Now, it's affecting users in Australia. We're talking major banks, telcos, media companies, uh, Sky News, obviously. ABC Radio was completely down last time we saw it as well. But it's right around the world. This is an international company. We can see here what it's doing as well to our screens. Uh, we're talking, we've seen users in the US, in Europe, in Asia, New Zealand, right around the world this is happening. So this will be a massive story. There are offices everywhere that have just gone completely down, people unable to work, there'll be payment systems not working, uh, and all sorts of issues, including for telcos. Remember that last outage for Optus and all the, the issues caused there? So this is massive. As I said, we believe the company is CrowdStrike, that's the belief at the moment. The last contact we had, had by the way, with the Minister's office was that uh, the belief was it was going to be CrowdStrike involved and they were working to fix their systems, but it's up to them to do it. So the stress on that is it's not a, a hack, if you like, where the government has to try to ward it off. It's a systems issue within CrowdStrike when an update happens. So once that update has been pushed through across the world, as soon as that update happened, companies are just going down, including here at Sky News. So you can see this is the situation right now in the studio. 